Touchdown, Longview! Well, welcome back, everyone. Longview stretched their lead to 37-7. Well, a six-play drive that time. Good running by DeCedric Hunt. And then it was capped off on a 13-yard run by Keelan Shaw. And that's 37-7, 6-24, left third quarter. Marty Hodge will kick it off for Longview. They've got both their kickers in the game. Here's Haas with a kick. Hobbs kicks this one high, and it's going to be deep, and it's going to go to D. Boyd at the four-yard line. Back he comes up the field. He turns up, and he is nailed at the 12-yard line. Boy, that was nice kick coverage that time. Sure was, and they got downfield in a hurry. That's a great Will job. McQuarter was the first man down to make the tackle in. He sure was, and another player who practices hard and doesn't get a lot of playing time in the special team's key players, Adam Serter. He was down there also. Adam Serter and Will McWhorter. Great job there. It sure was. Will McWhorter went right down the field and made the tackle. So at the 13, Mount Pleasant will scrimmage first and 10. 37-7 our score. 6-18 to go third quarter. Mount Pleasant football at their own 13-yard line. Spread formation. Two wides to the far side of the field. One to the near side. Tied in on the far side of the field on first down and 10. And Howard's going to run the ball. He's got some opening. He's got some room. He got a first down. And there's a, f- is there a flag. No, I, what it got me was he was tackled downfield by Bubba Vactor. Oh, he yeah. came from his defensive tackle position and turned around and ran. Uh, got it out to the 26. down. And it's a first down for Mount Pleasant with 6-12 to go third quarter. 37-7. Longview leads in Mount Pleasant football. Wow. 28 to 7, Texas High. Some reason that doesn't surprise me. I, I, you know, I just. I thought Texas High had, had a little more, a few more folks. Texas High definitely has a lot more speed overall, and I bet you that's a big part of that. Hey, keep it on the ground. Howard's going to run it. He got a first. No, he didn't get a first down, but he got a nice first down run of seven yards. It's going to be second down and three out to the 32 yard line. Clock continues to move with 5.36 to go here in the third quarter. Longview 37 and Mount Pleasant 7. And Joe Brown in the game for Longview. Boo Howard made the tackle that time Joe on Terrell Howard. And here comes Boo Howard out of the game. Joe Brown will come in. In 5A action in the third quarter, Robert E. Lee 7, Mesquite 3. Second down and 3. For Mount Pleasant at their own 32-yard line. As Howard, he gives it up the middle of the running back, and he got a first down just across the 35 to the 36-yard line. I think that was Kendrick Walker on the carry. Walker on the carry. It was Walker. Just gets across enough for the first down. 185-pound senior running back. So with four minutes and 59 seconds to go in the third quarter, it's 37-7 Longview and Mount Pleasant football at their own 36-yard line. Red formation for Mount Pleasant on first down and 10. Here's Howard back to throw. They're going to throw the quick screen. And Longview is there with a tackle at the 39-yard line, a gain of three yards on the play. That was a nice play by Britt Eastburn. Also on the stop for Longview was Cameron Jones, a sophomore linebacker. He's getting a lot of action tonight. Brent, I think he's one or two players that might have been brought up this week. I think Damian Jones was another one. Coach King said he brought two up. Well, I don't remember him being there before tonight. I think that is. But a nice pickup of five, second down and five. Well, I've learned one thing. I don't care what classification they are. If they put them out on that field, they can play. (laughs) They're out there for a reason. Yeah. You're not going out there if you can't (laughs) play, brother. First down and ten, or second down for Mount Pleasant. Here's the snap back. Howard rolls to the far side. He's going to turn up. Now he pitches it back. They've got some room to run. Down the sideline and to the 43-yard line of Longview is Mount Pleasant. Well, that's a nice play there. The, the speed option, once again, Howard had it out there. Howard pitches the ball to Craddock. Craddock on the carry. Picked up good yardage. Moved down inside Longview's 45-yard line. Longview's got some... 
some uh, new players in the game, and I don't, I don't. Uh, the front four is still the same, but they've got some new linebackers in. As you said, Cameron Jones, the sophomore, is in there. And uh, also... Thomas Jones is in at linebacker. Yeah. That was the other one. Both two sophomores out there at linebacker now for Longview. First down and 10, Mount Pleasant for the Longview 43. And they give it up to Craddock, and Craddock got a couple of yards to the 41-yard line. It's going to be second down and eight. Clock moves, 3.33 to go in the third quarter. 37-7 Longview. Damian Jones on that tackle for Longview, along with uh, Jeremiah Farley. Well, I, I've learned that much. If you if they put somebody out on that field, <laughs> they're not just ordinary sophomores trotting out no. there. Second down and eight. Here's Howard from the spread. Back to throw it he goes. Here comes Knight, and there's a quick pass. It's caught by Bowers and tackle at the 30-yard line and a first down. Tackle there on the play by the sophomore Cameron Jones. Well, that's a good play there. Second time they've gone to that tight end delayed pass out in the flat and a good catch by Bowers. Knight put some pressure on, just didn't quite get there in time. So with 2.52 to go third quarter, it's 37-7 to Longview. And Mount Pleasant football at the Longview 29-yard line. First down and 10 at Longview's 29. Spread formation again. Wide receivers to the far side, two of them, and one to the near side along with the tight end. There's the quarterback, Howard, back behind the line. Caught for a three-yard loss. First play, uh, uh, Chris Knight was the first one in there. And then a host of other Lobos in there as well. Cameron Jones Jones. also there. He's been in on almost every play. And here come some new players in. Loss of four on the play. Second down, 14. Stefani, I think Stefani Stanfield is also in the game for Longview. So it's second down. It's second down and 13. And the line of scrimmage is the Longview 33-yard line on second down and 13. Here comes Longview with some pressure. The ball thrown out. It's caught out there, and it's caught in Longview with a tackle. I think that was uh, Joe Brown who made that tackle for Longview. He did at the 23-yard line, so it's third down, and Mount Pleasant needs four. Well, that was a good job by Howard that time. He stayed in there under pressure knowing that he was going to be hit, and he was by Templeton came in there, but the completion moves the ball down to Longview's 23-yard line, third down, four. One twelve, and the clock moves, 37-7 Longview. And when this one snapped, it's going to be under a minute to go here in the third quarter. Third down and four for Mount Pleasant. Howard is going to roll back to the far side. He's got a man out there, caught for a first down, and a tackle made at the 11-yard line. So first down and goal, Mount Pleasant at the Longview 11-yard line. That was Boyd on the reception there. Nice gain, another first down. So Mount Pleasant moving deep in Longview territory. Ball just outside the 10-yard line. Let's call it the 11. Stephanie Stanfield made the play for Longview along with Britt Eastburn. So it's a first down for Mount Pleasant at the Longview 11, 37-7 with 45 seconds to go in the third quarter. And the clock moving. Spread formation again for Mount Pleasant on first down and 10. The quarterback's going to run it. He got a couple of yards to the 10-yard line, and that's probably going to end the third quarter. I don't think Mount Pleasant can snap it again before the fourth quarter starts. 37-7 20, 37-7 is our score. We'll see if they can get another snap off. I think that's going to be it. Quarterback's going to the sideline here. That should yeah. be the end of the third. 37-7 our score. Longview on top of Mount Pleasant. We'll be back with the final quarter after this one-minute timeout. <laughs> 